Is Habi Kadiawan. From its early days as Udog Etnika and Moda Mindanao, Habi Kadiawan has given birth to some of the biggest names in the local fashion industry. It is by far the most important project of the Davao Fashion and Design Council, parallel to City Ordinance Number no. 0120-19, granted by the local government of Davao in 2019. DFDCFI is, so far, the only creative support organization awarded an ordinance in the country. Thank you to the City Council and Mayor Indaisara Duterte for recognizing the soft power of the creative economy before becoming a national initiative. First held in 2017, Habi Kadayawan and Kadayawan Ball are creative platforms of the Davao Fashion and Design Council's veritable artists and designers. The Fashion Accessories and Lux Apparel Design Competitions featured four categories Student, Professional, Hobbyist, and Artisan. Since their inception, Habi Kadayawan and Kadayawan Ball have paved the way to showcase the artisanal culture and heritage of Davao's 11 ethno-linguistic groups. The competitive platforms promoted creative social enterprise among its winners and alumni through design ideation, and business incubation programs and grants. It has also served as a springboard in crafting a distinct fashion brand for Davao in apparel and accessory design. Before the pandemic hit, Habi Kadayawan extended its reach to the entire Mindanao, inviting more artists to participate and represent the deep and colorful cultures of the Mindanaoan. Habi Kadayawan's last live showcase featured functional, marketable, and original fashion accessories and formal luxwear featuring iconic patterns, materials, and techniques from the artisanal culture of Mindanao tribes. My name is Maan Chua, a singer-songwriter from Davao City. I do beadworks and I design accessories. Um, as of the moment, I'm just a daughter of Mindanao who does uh, works closely related to Mindanao. Uh, I use my background in music to be able to incorporate my designs into into the art and culture of Mindanao. Nang lupang tuyo It paved the way for me to be able to venture into design because uh, before I I only do music and songwriting and perform and then when Habi um, came about it gave me a a new avenue to be able to explore my artistry in terms of uh, beadworks and accessories. Habi um, helped uh, enhance my branding and my enterprise uh, because it made me explore my artistry into fashion design uh, using accessories. Uh, I've, I've been doing this before but haven't really thought of exploring on it more. But since Habi happened, uh, It, it gave me a chance to be able to do something different with the with, uh, designs that, that, that I do in terms of accessories. Um, I think music, art, and design come hand in hand, hand, in hand very closely, so uh, it wasn't very hard for me to be able to incorporate music, uh, design, and culture into the works, works that I do. It's also a big advantage for I mean, someone like me who was already exposed with culture, 
uh, music and other traditions and I was able to also use that strength to create something different when, when I ventured into design. In fact, now I'm working with a collab with Mr. Kublai Milian. Uh, he will be using my designs into his uh, paintings and incorporate them. I just continue doing your passion and what you're passionate about because uh, at the end of the day, it's, it's, uh, it's your call. Eh? So if, if you're able to express your artistry whatever way you can in terms of like fashion design or accessories or artworks, just continue doing it. And finally, you'd be able to find your own niche, your, your own identity, and then someday grow bigger. As long as you don't lose that passion and then continue what you're doing, continue doing what you love to do, then you're on the right track. Habi has so much potential. I'm, I'm, I'm lucky enough to be able to be a part of the first Habi and doing it. And a few years later, they're, they're still here, meaning they're doing the right thing for upcoming uh, designers, um, hobbyists, and, and also professionals. Uh, I hope that it, it would expand more and uh, I hope they, they, uh, Habi would be able to inspire more designers out there and hopefully it would expand in the, in the national if not international level because it's very, it, it's, it's very promising it, and, in, and it has changed um, lives or, of um, many designers I'm sure. It's also good that the ones behind working within Habi are doing what they're doing. Uh, because you know that they have so much passion in them, that's why they are continuing to doing it now. And I'm sure it will continue in the uh, following, following years to come. And I'm excited on, on what else they would discover. Assalamu alaikum. Madayaw o mayong adlaw kaninyong tanan. Magandang araw sa inyong lahat. Since the first edition of Habi Kadayawan in 2017, the design platform has always excited us. Davao City continued to commit an all-out support for this brainchild platform of the local government and Kadayawan. We continue to look forward to Habi Kadayawan discovering and supporting new generation design talents and contributing significantly to the creative economy. Core, Habi Kadayawan remains a springboard from where Davao artists leap beyond fame and recognition. Many thanks to Mayor Indaisara Duterte and the Kadayawan Executive Committee, led by the late Gachi Gachalian, who nurtured the idea. Habi Kadayawan also provides the opportunity to ideate and conceptualize design ideas from our local culture, heritage, and identity and incubate them into mainstream businesses for busting Davao's creative economy. Mabuhay ka, Dabawin. Mabuhay, Davao City. This is Habi Kadayawan. 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 Mahalin natin ang Pilipinas. Salamat ilaw ng kapayapaan.